hi dear students welcome to mn maths and in this video we will discuss discuss our next topic which is stretches and uh, compressions so uh, in my previous lectures i already explained about the translation of a graph and reflection of a graph so um, now uh, this is a transformation of a graph uh, the next section which is stretches and uh, compression so uh, before start the compression if you are not subscribed my channel please subscribe it and uh, now just we just start the lecture uh, whenever multiply a constant uh, c positive constant i just mention here a positive constant when we multiply a positive constant by our function f of x has uh, geometrically effects so dear students whenever uh, uh, we uh, multiply our constant by our function f of x then uh, there is just uh, uh, some geometrically effects on our graph so which say as stretching so whenever we multiply c by f of x uh, has a geometrical effect which say as uh, stretching if if uh, the c is uh, greater than uh, 1 so uh, the stretching of this graph is in a direction of y so uh, just uh, right here if we multiply uh, c by f of x and c is greater than 1 so whenever we multiply a constant by our function y is equals to f of x uh, it becomes just like i just write here whenever we multiply uh, c by this function then it becomes like as y is equals to c f of x and this whenever this c is greater than 1 then our function is stretch uh, in direction of x so our function is uh, stretch means uh, we just uh, uh, stretching in a direction of y or we also uh, we are, uh, can say it uh, we uh, stretch our graph vertically so the example to understand this stretching in the direction of y i just take example which says we have a function y is equals to cos x and we multiply a constant which is greater than one so i multiply two y is equal to so the graph uh, the in a, in a green color is a graph of stretching and uh, y in a black uh, marker color is just uh, our actual graph which is y is equals to cos x so uh, this line shows the stretching about uh, the y axis in the direction of y axis this is uh, our actual graph in, uh, in in black color this is our actual graph but in a green color this is our stretching after multiplying c which is uh, uh, already i mentioned it is greater than one so our graph is stretching in the direction of x uh, y axis so this is a stretching in a y uh, direction so whenever our c this c is uh, uh, 0 to 1 because I already write here c is a positive so c must be greater than equal um, greater than uh, 0 so that means uh, whenever c is uh, between 0 to 1 c is 0 to 1 then our graph will be compressed in the direction uh, in the in wide axis direction so our graph will be compressed uh, in uh, y axis y axis direction so I just write here whenever c is multiply uh, um, c is between 0 and when uh, 0 0 and 1 then the graph of y of y is equals to f of x is compressing in the y uh, direction in y axis direction so uh, i just write here i have a function uh, y is equals to i just uh, take a same function which is also uh, mentioned in above example and uh, we have y is equals to cos x and uh, whenever we multiply so I, uh, uh, dear students I already explained here uh, right here whenever c is uh, less than 1 then 1 over c must be belongs to 0 to 1 so uh, so 1 over c when we multiply 1 over c by a cos maybe as yes, the value of c is one, uh, 2 3 4 up to so on, uh, sorry c is between uh, 0 to 1 so uh, c may be uh, you can say uh, 0 0.5 uh, 0 0.1 and at, uh, up to so on so whenever we multiply uh, 1 over c to our function cos x then our function is compressed in the direction of 
uh, y so this is in and the graph uh, in in black color is our actual graph which is y is equals to x and when we multiply 1 over c the factor 1 over c by our function then our function is compressed is compressed in our uh, y direction so this this is uh, compress uh, compressing of a uh, graph in a y direction so dear students uh, now i just uh, explain our next topic uh, next thing this is compressing of a graph in x direction so in uh, here i just write here a compressing of a graph in x direction so to understand the graph uh, the compressing uh, of a graph in x direction i just uh, write here sometimes we multiply a constant c by our independent variable x yes students sometimes uh, uh, we multiply c uh, by our independent variable x uh, then if c is greater than 1 then our graph is compressed in x direction so uh, I, I already uh, write here y is equals to cx so when uh, at that uh, in the in this kind of uh, 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 compressing we multiply a constant by directly by our independent variable x so in such a case our graph is compressed in x axis direction so uh, here also the condition is that c must be greater than 1 so uh, to uh, understand this uh, compressing in the direction of x I already uh, write uh, I, I draw a graph uh, which is uh, I just write here in a in black color the, this is the actual graph of y is equals to cos x and uh, uh, in, in green color in green color graph that is y is equals to cos c x c may be uh, 2 3 4 because c uh, we have to take the c greater than equals to uh, greater than to 1 uh, so maybe c here is 2 3 up to so on so uh, we we say that uh, in in this uh, type of compressing our graph is compressing in direction of x so this is our uh, in a black color is our actual graph and in green color the graph of uh, the the the, uh, the curve in a green color is compressed as compared to uh, uh, the curve in a black color so uh, this is a compressing of a graph in x direction and this is the condition whenever c is greater than 1 and we have we have to multiply c by our independent variable so dear students uh, here uh, the next thing is stretching stretching of a graph in x direction so when our c is uh, between 0 to 1 similarly when we multiply c by our independent variable x then it becomes uh, same like y is equals to f of cx and c is between uh, 0 to 1 then uh, our graph will be stretched in direction of x so i just ex uh, already explained here uh, this is the actual graph uh, which is uh, mentioned in black color so when we multiply by a number which is uh, between 1 to 0 by our uh, uh, independent variable x then our graph will be stretched uh, in the direction of will be stretched in the direction of x axis so in a green color this is a stretching of our graph of uh, cos x so uh, dear student in this video i just tried uh, to explain uh, the stretching and compressing of uh, diff, uh, graphs you can take another example and uh, solve in your home and try to understand Thank you for watching my video and also subscribe my channel and press the bell icon button and also if you uh, give some feedback please uh, you can comment in my video and uh, also you can mail me I already uh, uh, drop my email address in uh, description. Thank you for watching.